buddy it's nerp here and today we're gonna go first and if you don't remember we won the first two matches in this series of deck wars and we have another good starting hand i don't know what i want to sack he's not gonna be decay he's not gonna be energy he's gonna be either order or growth and against order or growth he might get a turn one ragged wolf and kill me better um i do like all these things i'm gonna sack the ragged wolf i have a feeling he's gonna be like late game order or something he already, uses, he already used aggro order in the first series, so he can't be aggro order again. I have a feeling he's late game order. And if that's so, I want to definitely keep the fang there and all this stuff. And he's growth, and he gets the ragged wolf. Ooh. Okay. Not much I could could have done to protect that. I was definitely playing that. Um, I'll sack the breaker. And now we're, let's see, is he aggro growth or is he mono, like late game growth? Not late game, but you know what I mean. Like quake growth, quakes in god hands if he's quakes and god hands girl i think we have the advantage i think if you're playing a mirror match the faster your deck wins and it looks like he might be playing like a later game growth because this is usually not in those types of games and oak blood is really good i'm going to um i want to keep on i want to keep hold of that oak blood kind of no nah, i can't yeah i can't i'm not gonna do it so i do get the first like actually good creature out on the, fo on the field play that right there oh blood, i really like but i mean you're gonna keep drawing enchantments so i'll put against growth a growth deck is actually really good but i need to keep the two cards that i have, have in my hand I, I need to get those two creatures at the next two turns what's he doing with our mystic okay i was saying there's a chance he was playing go draw we haven't seen him play that yet stag card is good against growth as well we're gonna sacrifice that He's not at a point where he can play veterans yet. Um, let's see. I'm going to put you back there. We have two four health things. That's good. Now, a veteran probably won't help us that much because he's a sister of the fox protecting his stuff. But he is going to play something this turn. Probably. Hopefully not a rat king. Stag card. Okay. So. I, I kind of wish I kept that stag card. Ooh, an oak blood. Let's go ahead and draw an enchantment. Stag heart. Let's go ahead and sack that. And I'm going to play the ranger in front. That protects us from an incoming veteran. And if he does want to engage us, we have an oak blood, a stag heart to put in that bear. So I, it's, it's interesting. If oak blood on this would give it magic armor, and that means when it draws an enchantment, it's going to, uh, it's not going to take any damage. So I don't, I don't know. I want to put the oak blood though on the strongest thing. These growth does not have any purifications. It's not going to be able to get rid of a massive threat very easily. It's not going to be able to do it. And he gets a Great Wolf. My deck does not have Great Wolves. I think he's more of a mono growth, like later growth, not like this aggro version. Uh, I think it's going to be... Where do I want to put Oak Blood in the front guy? Interesting, interesting, interesting. Let's go ahead and... Uh, Could have, I don't know if you even know if he has rumbles. Let's play another mystic and let's play a stag heart. Let's move up. And he could get like a mangy wolf. Just that's a chance. We're gonna play a mystic and now do we want to put the stag heart? What do we want the stag heart on? But they are obviously, I think, something more useful on. So we have to hope that it doesn't have it. Now, we have to decide. So if he's a mangy, it's going to hurt a little bit. We want to get a rally. Um, stag heart and a mangy. Oh, man. Stag heart, mangy wolf. Ow. Ah, yeah, I think those are just two cards. Oh, man. He has stag heart, mangy wolf. Those are the two cards he needed. Doesn't kill him quite. Now I can get an oak blood here. So let's go for the oak blood. And a ragged wolf. And I'm gonna hope he doesn't have another mangy wolf. If he does, I don't think it would be devastating. We still have this bear going on. It's a battle between Relentless dudes. His relentless dude is uh, eight attack. Mine is only six attack. 
a veteran. Okay, that's all he's gonna do. Play the veteran. Did he not sack for scrolls there? Yeah, because he wanted to get rid of both of my guys there. Not too bad. Um, and I'm. Oh, rally's really good. I'm gonna sack the rally. I'm gonna sack that. Oak blood again. Uh, I wanted to keep the rally because I, I mean, probably I need to use it. If I go with the veteran, five attack, boom, you're dead. You get lower attack, so let's go with that. And I don't think that means we're gonna die just yet. It does mean we're close to dying. <laughs> now you have two attack and no we're levelless. So we do want him to play a human. <laughs> And he does play human, but that means we're going to lose our guy. It's pretty important. I think we lost the match. We lost the match by moving up from the bottom row here and trying to engage him because I, I thought we were safe. I mean, I don't fault myself that much because with six resources having the... Uh, yeah, with six resources having the... Uh, whatever it's called, the stag heart and the mangy wolf was was pretty awesome. So I don't fault myself that much. I think I thought it was the good play at the time. It backfired because he had the perfect cards to come down and punish me, and we kind of lost this match. Unless I can like get like another bear and like three stag hearts, but we're not gonna surrender. Even though I almost want to. <laughs> so we should start thinking of what we're gonna do to combat this deck. Because that means what's what because if he wins this match and he wins the next match, then he ties it up and it goes to game five. So we don't want to let him win this match and the next match. And we're kinda dead here. Uh Wildling Oak Blood. I mean Sure it's good, but I'll sack the Crimson Bull. That's a good card. It's going to come in handy. But I think my best bet here is to um, get up top. And then somehow get like an Oak Blood off on that wild lane. Get a Rat King next to it. And uh, have these one counts on the unit storm back on the field. But he'll probably win the game by the time I can get that to go. Okay, I'm not really sure what kind of deck he's using, because I haven't seen him go to like God Hands yet, but he's using Great Wolves and Mangy Wolves, which usually isn't in aggro order, but he's using Enchantments, which is in aggro order. Okay, so um, we're just about dead, especially if it's like a Rally at his hand. Okay, uh, what are the things I can go to to combat this deck of his? He has to, of course, he's gonna play it again. And we see one more win to win the second series, and even the whole deck wars up because he won the first series. We choose range energy or or a poison, de poison order decay. Poison decay order, whatever you want. I think the poison decay order is gonna be better. But it doesn't really matter, really, because if I lose the other one, I just play with the other one because I have two chances to beat him. But let's try to finish it as soon as possible. So we'll go with the, the decay first. And if that doesn't work, we'll have to resort to the range energy, which might not be good. Uh, da, da, da. I'll sack. I, I know the Fangler's probably our only chance getting back in this game because it's relentless. Whatever. Um, let's move down. We're kind of dead. We're really dead. Give you a blood. Get rid of this uh this thing. I feel like he he has zero cards a lot. I think two times this match he drew a veteran and didn't and didn't sack it because he needed to draw the veteran there. Two times that match he did that, and then another two times I think he just like played all the stuff. And that's GG. GG WP. Okay, so we win the games one and two. He wins game three, and we're now we have two chances to beat him in a specified series to take the series win and tie the whole thing up. And uh, let's go for Poison Decay first because that should have an advantage over this deck and has damage curses. So 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed, subscribe, and like, and see you next time.